This tutorial is how to download and install Visual Studio 2022 Community Edition step by step. Link available in the description box below. First of all, I'm going to download Visual Studio 2022 Community Edition. Click to download. It's downloading now. In the load directory. This is the installer. Just run it. Continue. It's installing. Please wait. This is the features uh, ASP.NET Web Development and .NET Desktop Development. I will install this uh, two. Uh, and the total space required 8.31 GB. And you can see, click on install. Okay, it's installing Visual Studio Community 2022. Okay, please wait. Now start after installation. Just select start after installation so that it will be started after completing the installation. Okay, it's started now. Now you can sign in or you can skip this for now. Select the theme. Theme is I just selected theme blue. Start Visual Studio. Yes, Visual Studio is started successfully. Now you can create new project or you can open project or you can continue without code. Okay, it's started without creating any project. Now I'm gonna create new project. Select language C sharp platform desktop Windows platform and project type is desktop. Click on next. I'll select the Windows form uh, f.net framework and then click on next. Uh, project name test windows f and location select the directory where the project will be created this is the d drive and or the uh, visual studio f folder name select the folder and then yes this is the directory where it will be created now select place solution and project in the same directory and then click on create it's creating yes it's created successfully now to get the toolbox, go to the view, toolbox, add a text box and add a button control to test the project and uh, now get the property window, yes, change the font size of this button and text is click, yes, double click to uh, get the click event, yes, this is the button click event, now declare a variable string, a string channel equal to text box one dot text message box dot show channel what text i will write in the text box one it will display as message box let's check debug yes thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more helpful content like this see you in the next video